G'day lamb lovers, Greg here. Well, it's product review time once again, and today I'm gonna to be trying this Aussie classic right here. The on the menu pub favorites lamb cutlet. Delicious crumb lamb topped with gravy, served with a smooth potato mashed peas and carrots. Mm -hmm. How good does that sound? And I mean, it actually looks pretty good too, Ooh, yeah. Who doesn't love a nice crumb bit of lamb? Oh yeah. But I wonder how much lamb is actually in this. Well, let's see. Well, mashed potato is 28% and that's made with potato flakes, you ripper. Lamb cutlet, 25%. Ah, oh, sweet ass, bro. And then there's all the other things, plenty of numbers in there, all these different numbers, actually, and boy, that's a lot of numbers. Carrots are 16% and peas, 10%. Well, to me, 25% sounds pretty all right. Well, I wonder if it's even good for us. <laughs> Probably. Well, at nearly 1,500 kilojoules, it's, you could have like six of these a day. Well, there's more fat than protein, and the sugars, well, we don't even want to see that, do we? We don't want to know about sugar in our food. Anyway, it's probably uh, sugar that's in the carrots anyway. Anyway, let's crack it open before we microwave this to see what it's like. Yum, yum, bubble gum, da 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 Woo-wee! Gee, that looks all right. Look at this gravy on here. Oh, and that mashed potato. And there's heaps more gravy down there. Right, how, well, how do we nuke this? Well, you can either nuke it or cook it in the oven. I'm gonna microwave this. So uh, remove frozen meal from carton and place in the microwave. Alrighty. Do not pierce or remove film. No worries. Heat on high for a thousand watts, five and a half to six minutes. Sure thing. Remove from microwave and allow to stand for one minute. I'm doing that. Carefully remove film and serve. All right, so straighten the nuca. Don't peel, don't pierce. Just whack it in. Five and a half to six. I'll go five minutes and, well, 50, uh, yeah, yeah, cares, mate. I was gonna go five minutes 45, but what's five seconds amongst friends? Alrighty, well, it's all ready. Ooh. Oh. Looks like something I found in the toilet this morning. But does it look anything like the picture here? Well, uh, hmm. Well, sort of. Looks okay-ish. But how about we look at this piece of meat? Well, it doesn't look like there's any bone in it. Mmm. And, well, it does look pretty processed, though, doesn't it? Ugh. Now, before I get stuck into that meat, let's try some of this potato. Love a good mashed potato. Unless it's not a good one. Mmm. That tastes pretty nice. That processed mashed potato made with potato flakes. Mmm, yeah. Mmm. So dry and powdery. What about these peas? So average. And these carrots? They taste almost real. What about this gravy? Not something you want to be eating on its own. Okay, well, let's go to some of this lamb. Mm. Man, it tastes all right. It, it even resembles lamb. I mean, it's it's more like a, a kebab or something than a like a real, like, proper piece of lamb meat. I mean, it's fully processed and everything, but I mean, it still tastes all right in that soggy coating on top. I'm sure it probably would have been pretty good if you whacked it in the old oven to reheat it. I mean, it tastes all right. It's nothing flash, but were you expecting it to be? I know I wasn't. But would I get this one again? Well, you know what? If I was looking for food to whack in the old freezer, keep for later days, when I'm too lazy to cook, yeah, mate, I'd get one of these. Why not? It tastes all right. You're getting your meat, you're getting your mash, you're getting some veggies. I mean, it's all the food groups covered right here, almost. 
in a nice convenient frozen meal. Anyway, there's the on-the-menu pub favourites lamb cutlet. Is it something that you might be interested in getting at some stage? If it is, good on you, mate. Supporting the Aussie lamb industry. Put some lamb on your fork and chow on down. Well, I'm going to delightfully just stand here looking out my window at uh, birds flying by whilst eating a nice bit of lamb. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time I review something. See you then. Oh yeah, this is Greg's Kitchen with a